you know, after the uh, after the Harvard projects and uh, and the subsequent experimentation that we did at Millbrook, uh, I spent ten, ten years in the study of this yogic system called Agni Yoga or Actualism, which is a Western-based uh, system of light fire yoga, very close to alchemy and Tibetan Buddhism, uh, but with its own set of methods and practices, which I led. And I didn't didn't use any psychedelic drugs whatsoever because I wanted to see well. You know, I wanted to give it a fair trial and see what what's possible uh, with it. And I've come to see those kinds of yogic methods as um, a crucial adjuncts for working with um, the, the drugs. I don't think the drugs, the psychedelic drugs, provide a method in themselves. <laughs> it's a tool, and so they can be used as an adjunct to, say, psychotherapy, or they can use, be used as an adjunct to yogic methods or meditative methods or shamanic practices. Um, but you, have a, uh, you, you need to have a conceptual framework uh, that, um, that in, in which these tools you know, can be able to, they, they act as amplifiers of perception. 